Hello. Today I got this LM3886 amplifier here. It's an XHY board. You can get this from the usual places, eBay, AliExpress, or Taobao. Here's the schematic here that came with the board. Okay. <clears throat> There is our power supply here. It's a plus or minus 30 volts power supply. And that's the amplifier there. I already mounted it to the heat sink. And we got connected to a 4 ohms resistor here. Today we're gonna uh, test the amplifier using a 4 ohms load. First we're gonna measure the output of the power supply. That's about 30.8 on the positive rail, 30.8 on the negative rail, about 61.7 from rail to rail. Today we're gonna measure the maximum power output of the amplifier using an 8 ohm load without any noise or ringing on the output for a 60 the amplifier is the LM this LM386 capable of 68 watts at 4 ohms load we're gonna see if we'll be able to achieve that without any noise on the output <coughs> so we need about 47 volts pick to pick to get 68 watts <coughs> Okay, so here it is. Our frequency is set to 1 kilohertz. The output is currently about 11.2 volt. Pick to pick, we're aiming for 47 volts. This is our signal gen here. I'm gonna adjust it to reach 47 volts. Okay, so that's about 48 volts there. So we need about 2.2 volts to get uh, 48 volts, 48.8. <coughs> so it was able to achieve 68 watts RMS at 4 ohms load. Let's see the okay, so that's the distortion there. We're currently at the one percent scale, so the full scale is uh, full scale is one percent, so that's about 0 0.36, 0 0.38, so less than 0 0.4, 0 0.4. So I got a fan here assisting the heat sink. Without the fan here, the the heat sink is very hot and uh, I cannot touch it. I think it's more than 70 degrees. I should have taken the temperature of that one, but never mind. So you <coughs> for a continuous output at 4 ohms at 68 watts, uh, decent cooling and <coughs> is needed for the IC. So that's it, 48.4 volts there. Let's see how much is that for on slow. Okay, 
minutes for 48.4 divide 8.4 divide 2.8 times 2 squared divide 4 so that's about 74.6 watts <coughs> you can see the sine wave there is pretty clean so the output is very nice and clean there 2.2 volts to pick input for the <coughs> for the 74.6 watts output so that's it guys <coughs> please subscribe subscribe if you like the video comments down below like or dislike thank you for watching see you next time